Hello there, Golf Freak here, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Civilization V as China, where we last left off. We were doing pretty dang well. It actually just occurred to me that I don't need all these riflemen here. So let's take these guys. Bring them down here. I think one rifleman will be fine. I can always rush by a cannon or something if I really need it. Send the great general down here as well. Okay, you alert. Oh, uh, they move up one more space each. Yeah, I want you there because I want you to be a naval city. And we are going to buy tiles. Okay, and purchase. A workshop. Purchase. Uh, let's go ahead and get an aqueduct. Purchase. Lighthouse, purchase the workboat, purchase yeah, purchase a harbor, why not? And I should probably build one over here. Go ahead and purchase a harbor, because that'll quickly connect it. And let's purchase a worker over here. I'll send him to build a road anyway. Spending lots of money. We're about to lose my golden age. Yada yada yada. We'll have you build a granary. Sounds good. Golden Age is over. I'm making about 100 gold per turn. Which is fine by me. Um, build a temple next. You alert. Priest, don't you be doing anything stupid now, you hear me? Looks like they almost can ready to attack me, but they could just be going after these guys. Sleep. Is Grease wary of me at all? Is there any reason for Grease to hate me? Let's see where you're at. There you are. I have made a declaration of friendship. Right, the only reason I'm friendly with you is because I'm a kind of a warmonger against um, Nebuchadnezzar. Whereas I'm friendly with Washington. Because I'm not going to go after Washington. He's got. City states basically blocking him, and like he's got a ton of desert tiles, so he probably probably does have a ton of production, but it's just not worth it. He just alert until we figure out how exactly how many units we have down here, and you can hit the fish. And you're gonna build a road over here. Wait, what? What the? Where the heck do you think you're going?
Man, game's getting laggy. It shouldn't be. So I'll play around the CPU left over. It's just like not being able to process all the game itself may not be able to process all the information quickly enough. It's just gonna have to build my own road over there. It's retarded. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's go. Four either way. I'm just going up to Dublin. If the brain were so sick, and we got biology and we're in the industrial area. Wow, someone's actually technologically ahead of us. Or at least got like rushed one of those really high techs. Um, build the hospital, yeah, in Beijing. Heck yes. And all we get now is military science. Um, and you need orders. You just alert. So we have my Greek defensive or maybe even attacking army. We would have to be careful, but I think we'll be fine. Uh, medic. Playing on a large map probably wasn't the best idea, but is the, the English maps not really worth it otherwise, or the Earth maps? Excuse me, not English maps. No. No trade agreement. Sorry. Yeah, Dublin's doing a pretty good job of defending itself. Oh, Mount Fuji, where is it? Thank you, it's the first national wonder I found, I'm fully aware. And that's the only one! Really? And of course it's in the middle of Japan, Durr. A the large earth map, that's the only one- Wow, really? Let's get over here. Build the army like right here. Probably go three and three. That should be more than enough to take care of them. You can come here. So there's the defensive units. So I could go against Greece and I probably could hold my own. We'll just focus mainly on expansion and growth for now. <laughs> Build a road. Eh, should we go over, actually? There's no point of going under. I'm not going to build a city. Yeah, I might as well go over. Because if I do decide to go after Nebuchadnezzar, it'd be the easiest way to connect a road this way. I guess. Not that it really matters, but... Production. Build a seaport. Actually, you guys come over here. coming 
So many cities, though. Thankfully, they all have decent product or er, production or er, uh, culture. So policies aren't being too expensive. Thankfully, uh, build the hospital. Build the hospital. Let's build hospitals. Like our growth is not a bad thing for us. Um, hitting this because we get plus one culture from every building. Yeah. So we got. 241, boost this up to 264, we get a free policy, we're gonna grab Theocracy. Yeah, because future policies get reduced by 10%, and temples increase gold output, so we should be getting more gold as well. Yeah, that's not bad. Probably go down order next. Honestly, freedom does not really mean that much to me. Ah, and see, it doesn't actually have freedom here anyway. So that works out. Okay, so where do you think... Are you coming to attack me? It really looks like it. Like, you really want to play this game with me? Like, I'll build up another army just to protect against you, too. Is he really that pissed off at me? Um, yeah, I guess he, sh he should be. Mean him dead -ish. Let's be friends. No. Um, here, I'll give you sugar, free of charge. Or what are you giving me for this? Sure, I'll take it. And doesn't even like the fact that... I How about gold? What will you give me for this? Yeah, no. Straight up. And if he declares war on me, then I get it back, so... Whatever. You just alert here. Dude, Nebuchadnezzar, I will be pissed off if you attack me. Like, I'm, I'm fine, you're not a threat at all. See, what does it say? I need more military units. Wow, really? Nothing. But yeah, they're they're gonna attack me. Uh, let's get you over here. a really stupid move on their part because that's just asking me to kill them. So now. It wouldn't even be that hard for me to do that. Okay, you're guarded from me. Why? Ah, because of my culture policies and they want to be friends with Bucharest. Crap. So, India is now friends with America. So that can harm my relations with America. I don't really want to be harmful with America. Because they're, they're militarily strong. So... We'll have to see. Um... You go here. You go here. And you're good now, because we've got we've got enough units to defend against them. They're they're pathetic. If I really I can hold them off long enough to get more units down there. And just come on down here for now. I'm trying to get a grasp on how many units I have. And you can now build me the hospital so you can grow faster. You alert. Uh, you alert. Keep going Dublin. Like, seriously, knock these guys out. Yeah, they got oil down here. I'll probably put a city, like, right down here. And 
I really want India. Hurry up and produce all your stuff, guys. And okay. Next turn. No open borders. Oh my gosh, they're gonna clear war on me. There's no way they're not. Wars may be fought. I really don't wanna have to deal with them. There's no reason for them to be pushing that many units forward unless they are gonna declare war on me. Uh military academy is another fifteen can only do this. We're gonna send you out this way. And we are going to straight up purchase a military academy and a cannon. And we're going to have you per build another cannon up. Choose research. Um, we don't have coal yet. And we're, we'll probably get it within that much turn, but we'll definitely get dynamite, because artillery would just make us unstoppable. Uh, you come down here. Um, is this a hill? Yes. You just to come on up here. So you have side advantage. As soon as they hit that war, I'm just going to start pushing them. Probably in the winning too. There's just like there's just no way that they're not gonna look at me with this push of units here. They're seeing this area as being probably undefended. We're alert. With artillery I'll be unstoppable. There's no way. Is it gonna happen right now? No? Fine, because I'm if I'm preparing for an attack, then um, I'll still be better off than without. America's becoming friends with everyone, which can cause problems. But at least I'm not being friends with uh, India, because that'd be a major problem for me. But we're all good. Barbarians, okay. And we got a great artist that has been born. Okay, so do we want to pop any territory? Is there any territory that I want to be mine, mine, mine? I don't think so. I mean, I guess I could connect these two, but that should have happened eventually anyway. Um, I don't really need to take over any of his stuff, so we'll just pop him for a uh, short golden age. And all his units retreated. Okay, well we're just gonna go ahead and get that that two those two riflemen and the cannon. You keep on exploring. Got all, I've got enough riflemen, I'm pretty sure, to destroy India. And I'm also going to include these guys. I'm going to just push a little bit this way. So. You are going to be up here. Should you just come in my city? Pop you. And next turn. Sorry, I have no interest in this arrangement.
Okay, we're looking real good. Uh, the Louvre or the Grand Duport Gate. Oh, and another 15 XP for all units built in this city? Okay, well, we'll just go ahead and rush this then. I did not know it did that. So, heck yes, we'll get that. Um, build the hospital here. Build the hospital here. Build the paper maker over here. You two fall back. I shake my finger at you at Babylon because they're just like, yeah, I want to see what he's got, and all of a sudden they realize, oh, he just got stronger in a split second. So we're not going to stand a chance against him. Barrage, siege. Is that three cannons? No, I need one more. I'll be able to upgrade them all. Before I push forward, and that'll just I'll be able to absolutely destroy anyone who wants to get in my way. Oh, look at that. The Greeks might take over Dublin. Pale death, BC. Okay, choose production. Uh, you finish that. Build the cannon. And the unit needs orders. And alert. And I, where's my great general? Ah, oh, he's right there. Sleep. Actually, they're great. His building right in that spot wouldn't be that bad of a placement if I was being attacked. Especially with artillery, that would be amazing. Yeah, like India is like almost trying to become friends with me. Choose production. Um, we probably should build some cavalry, yeah. Let's get a couple cavalry units. Right, you can actually get another one. Barrage too. Heck yes. And you get over here. Everybody's growing, which is good. My happiness is maintaining. I need to check to see if Babylon has uh, finally flipped. And they're going against Babylon too. I imagine Babylon's going to get almost all my unhappiness. And you're done. In fact, you're probably done a little while ago. Default and build a windmill. Boost your production a little bit. Choose production. Um, hmm. Plus four culture. Yeah, we can use. We might as well just do this and then get, use them to pop the great artists for a golden age.
So you can automate, so you can do whatever the heck you want to do. That is fine. And... One more turn for dynamite. And I'm going to make sure to save up my gold to make sure I can completely upgrade all of my units. Yeah, everyone's hating on Babylon now that they're not powerful. Tend to do that. I do actually have a city down there. Huh. I am a little tempted to say yes because I really want to be friendly with America. But I have really no incentive of doing that, and I'm not too keen about going to war at this point in time with Nebuchadnezzar. Maybe in the future would be a possibility. As soon as men decide that all means are open. And... Okay, uh, steam power. Production. Stable, maybe? Might as well. Uh, build the hospital. Upgrade. Wow, I'm gonna upgrade two right now. I'm going to save up my gold. Oh, Dublin fell. It's going to make my job a lot harder if Greece declares war on me. I'll definitely go after Dublin first. Free it up. Get, uh, get them on my side. I imagine, I think they were militaristic, so... We shall see. And the good, 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 good. Wow, I lost 18 gold just from that one trade route. Kind of weird. Drill. And drill. And... Drill. Drill, 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 drill. And... Calvary. Again. And we'll send you down here. Choose production. Uh, build the... Aqueduct. Cause you're not growing very fast. Not that I'm really surprised, because you're in a desert, but still. Who's got money? You got money. But I don't think I can trade you any resources. Nope. You? Um, hello you. Nonsense. No. สวัสดีเราเชื่อว่านี่เป็นข้อเสนอที่จะทำสำหรับทั้งสองฝั่งเอ่อ uh, um, you got lots of gold I trust you are a friend to liberty oh wow I got Go lots ahead. of extra ivory 240 pose good All right. good 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 now Upgrade a couple more units. So I think Babylon is might declare war on me, or at least they're moving because America pissed them off. I think there's a definite possibility that that might happen. But we shall see.
And good. Set up range. And alert. Choose production. Finish the bank up here. Build the granary. Uh, finish the paper banker. Build the seaport. Do you want to default focus? Yep. Okay, good. Upgrade you. Who still needs orders? Garrison. So defensively, I should be fine because I've got the Great Wall and I've got the Kremlin. So it'll be relatively hard for anyone to attack me. Well, they can't attack me. So there are they attacking America? Is that it? Or are they just hate me along with America? Hmm, that's interesting. Okay, man. Spices, dyes, uh, dyes and pearls to him are done, so. I already you spent all your gold. No, you got enough for one more. But you can't because you apparently have them now. Are you making great people? Not worth mentioning. Build a military academy. Finish the hospital. Build me a coliseum. Okay. And we're going to start pushing down towards India. We're going to upgrade you because you guys are. You two are also going to be pushing. Now I should probably check all the relations to see what I can do. Keep from like absolutely destroying uh, all of my relations. I mean obviously I'm pretty sure he's gonna call me out on it this next turn. So there's no way that you can't tell by this that I'm gonna kill you. It's gonna happen. Um Arsenal. We'll give you drill, medic, and drill two. Okay, we finished the hospital. Build me a arsenal, I guess. Finish the granary, build the hospital. Adopt Policy. Well, we're going to go down order. One happiness per city. Factories increase science output. Uh, nationalism is good. The green building is good. And then more production is also good. It's not amazing. But I can't have this branch at the same time as either one of these two. And I can't have these two. I guess I could go commerce. Huh. Actually, we could go down commerce, but let's see. Uh, honor. Oh, 
Honestly, honor doesn't really appeal to me, but we'll go down commerce. I don't intend to win culturally. In fact, I don't even know how I'm going to win at this point. I might just want to buckle down and f pick a way to win. Okay, we're going to look at... Dun, 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 Gandhi. Uh, let's take, just take an actual look at you. Yeah, we're gonna take you out. Might piss off America. But I'm gonna go ahead and attack. Probably, but I don't really care. And his cannon is over here. Just says major victory. Well, with the beauty of my artillery, I can just range you and hang you up. And hopefully finish you off there. And then move these guys up. See what we got. Hmm. There is a threat of them coming through this way. But I can just buy units or something if that happens. And I've got units there. And I need to start upgrading these units. In case Greece gets pissed off at me for some reason. And we'll go ahead and go there and do nothing. Go one more turn. And Washington and Mechanism are officially at war. Well, they've just got pikemen. This is going to be too easy. They actually have landmarks, though. That's interesting. Go for the flank. Just destroy these guys. Go there. Whoa, hello. Wasn't quite expecting that. Welcoming, but this will be okay. Um, you on this mountain. You on this mountain. Here and Delhi's just right here, so heck yes. And they have marble. A city over here wouldn't be that bad either, but I just want to take Delhi. Um, sure, build walls. Right, but we're gonna be a little while. You haven't moved, and you only took one, two damage. You just heal and see what happens. Okay, you alert. And let's take a... We're at turn 2, uh, 75, so let's take a look at our demographics. We are first in everything, almost, except for soldiers. Apparently, Gre the Greece is better. Oh my gosh. And if Greek, the Greeks are better overall, and they're definitely better than what force I have pitted up, so I'm glad I have a decent force over there. Um, land, I'm in second. That's actually a relatively large amount, too. But I'm way above the average. Gross national product. Not really surprised if they have more cities than me. They probably have more gold. Uh, manufactured goods. I'm in first by a ton. Come over the average. And Japan is just getting their butt kicked. They probably lost their capital. And the crop yield. Yeah, dude. Jeez. It's Mon Mongolia. It's just around the other side. They're dominating the other side. 
if everything was connected, I might eventually go over there and try to wipe them out. But unfortunately, all the powerhouses are on my continent. So yeah, I'm going to cut this video off here. So thank you very much for watching, and God bless.